So here's the first one that we talked about, the bigger one, without the um, brand. I don't know which one this one is, but I'm going to try this one out right now. Hopefully it'll produce some bass. We're going right into that shade. Beautiful. Just tuned up my reel yesterday night, the Biomaster 2000. Love this thing. Oh, there you go. Look at the. Oh, come on. That was a small little bite there. Okay, by the dam. Oh, fish on. Fish on. Oh, yeah. Fish on. Oh, that's a good one, too. Look at that. Come here, baby boy. Okay, come on. Oh, man, look at you. Oh, no, no, no. There you go. Look at you. Ah! That sucker was ready to get out of there. Whew. That was a good one. Beautiful. I hate all these mishaps like this. Oh. I don't like having to net them like that. Unless I really have to, and that one I really have to because he was about to come off. But when you net him with the worm, it's different from when I net him with these hooks. Because these damn hooks just don't come off as easy as you would like. And, um, but y'all got to see that bass, and that's pretty cool. <laughs> Let me, uh, come back in a minute. I'm gonna take this apart. Okay, let's try this again. We went up on the dam and we caught what we were looking for. Now let's get a little bit further out and see if we can. And this is a, uh, I'm using the um, eight pound strand. I just put the sucker on, low vis green on this one. See, I just put the, um, the line on and it, I love the way it looks against the water right now. Okay. Recast. Whoa, check those hooks. Always check the hooks when it comes back up. Ah. Come on, you. Okay. There we go. Let it drop and... Fish on! Oh, fish on! <laughs> That's a little one. Ah, get over here, you punk. Look at this beauty. This is our next generation of bass. Check it out. Oh, you fit right in my hand. Look at this. Look at you. Look at you. What do y'all think? Look at that healthy population of bass. Look at that boy. There you go. Into the water. Look at that beautiful color. Come on. Yeah. So this one already got two, two hits, one after the other, on the same um, rod and reel and everything. So let's try it going three for three into the deep. So that one got three for three already. We're going to try, I mean, two for two. Here it comes again. This is third attempt on that same one. Fourth attempt.
Oh, it's crooked. Tangled up and everything. Okay. Let's count this number four. So as we bring these suckers in, you can feel the vibration and each one has its own, you know, mellow tone that I was showing you earlier. So we're going to try them all out. I mean, I want to give you all a good point of view on each one. So this is number five, fifth uh, attempt so far. One missed, two landed, one no bite. And that's number five. All right, not even an attempted bite. <clears throat> so today we are doing the storm wiggle ward side of this story. This is going to be the storm wiggle ward versus the Cordell wiggle O. This is your old school wiggle ward. That's how you determine right there which version it is. The ones that have the writing on the lip like that is your um what's called your pre rapala wards okay let me get this thing rolling and see where we're at okay i can see small bass over there You can immediately feel the vibration on the wiggle wart. Look at the rod's tip. Fish on, fish on, oh yeah. Ooh, that's a good one too. Come here, punk. <laughs> Look at this. Oh man. Yeah, no, 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 no. Wait a minute. Come back here. It's just holding on. Oh, come here. Oh yeah, beautiful. Woo wee. Look at you. Let's get that hook right out of your mouth real fast. Get you back in the water. Look at this. Oh, come on, Rapala. Rapala. <laughs> Woo, man, these suckers, I swear. <clears throat> Look at this mess now. Oh. Be back shortly. Woo, man. Look at this baby. <laughs> Got another good one. Rapala wiggle wart. Hard at work. Let's try it again. Man, that was crazy cool. <laughs> Man, I swear that was cool. You can feel everything with this little lightweight 
Um, the the reel, I still have no idea. I haven't even looked into it. I just bought it and I came over here and I started fishing with it, making some videos, and I forgot all about looking it up. So for meanwhile, I'll just call it the reel. Well, the reel has been doing great with all these different kinds of crankbaits. And we've been able to land some ooh, nice stuff. So today we're continuing to use the same one, but we tied on a old pre Rapala wiggle wart. And man, I swear to this has been it's been fun. Watch. Here goes another one. There you go. Fish on. Oh, oh God. Woo wee. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Come on, punk. Uh. No, no, no. Under the boat. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I got you right here. Let me help you out real quick. Don't hook me. Oh, my word. I just felt that sucker pull off. I think I had it in the mouth first and then it jumped off. But regardless, baby, you get to go back right quick. Ah, <sighs> oh, yeah. Right there. Sorry, baby. There you go. Look at that, another beauty. Mm. Oh, oh, oh. They love those wiggle warts. If not, we're gonna go right up against that tree. Uh oh, Ooh, I missed that sucker. 